Hi YouTube, I'm Iman, and welcome back to one of my auto repair videos. In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove the cowl, which is this black plastic piece, from a 2009 uh, Toyota Prius Hybrid, which also applies to a 2004-2009. There are many reasons for why you all want to do this, but for now, let's get to removing it. So first off, we're going to remove the cap for this windshield wiper right here, and all you have to do is stick your finger under the front and pry it out. If you can't pry it off using just your finger, you can use a prying tool like this. But uh, for me, the finger is just good. So we're going to set that aside for now. Make sure you don't lose it. Um, next step is there's a, I think it's a number 15 bolt or a nut here. Let me get the wrench. Just take it out by hand. Okay. I can screw it out by hand. Uh, one, also, one thing you also want to note when you're taking out the windshield, uh, no, the windshield wipers, is to always mark the position, the natural position of your windshield wipers. So you can see here, we marked it in red marker. And also on this side. Uh, also, if you have a dirty windshield, then you can just see where the position is because it leaves a mark. If you have a clean windshield, then you shouldn't uh, see a mark, so you definitely have to mark it. All right, so next up, we're going to leave this aside for now. And we're going to get to these two bolts. So these two are, I think they're also number 15. Okay, looks like they are as well. Uh, also remember to mark this windshield as well for its natural position. Just take these out. Set these aside. Uh, probably not on the cowl because we're going to take that off anyway. And then, finally, there are two screws, one on this side, uh, this one's broken, uh, but on this side, on the left side, there is one screw that we have to remove, so we're gonna get our screwdriver, and then just take it out. Okay, set the uh, fastener aside for now. The next step is to take out the windshield wipers. So we're going to start on the driver's side windshield wiper. Uh, it's spring-loaded, so in order to take it out, we're going to make it easier by lowering the uh, hood. Oh, okay, it's from the bottom. I'm not familiar with this car. All right, so just lower it. And now, we're going to get a look at the windshield wiper. So right now, we're not able to take it out. However, if we pull this back, don't worry about it if it breaks because it is spring-loaded. So, you heard that sound? It means it's spring-loaded. So, once you take it up, you're just going to be able to take it out. And on the bottom, you can see what the spring looks like, what the gear inside looks like. Uh, it's a bit too dark. And where it goes on to. So, we're going to set this aside for now and turn our attention to the passenger side. Where is it? Oh. Where is it? Okay. All right, so now we're gonna turn our attention to the passenger side windshield wiper, and you can just easily take it out. And like I said before, remember to mark your positions. In our case, we already have the imprint, so we don't have to worry about that. And we'll put that aside. Moving on to the next step, earlier when you were taking out these screws, you might have noticed that they were inserted into these fasteners. All you have to do is take out these fasteners just by prying them out. Uh, the screw was keeping them in, so they're easy to take out. I'm going to set that aside for now. And now we're going to take off the cowl. So in order to do that, let me get the light. In order to do that, you're going to look under, and you're going to see tabs, like this one for example. And what you want to do is you want to take a flathead, and then you want to insert it into these, the, the, the tiny holes they leave, and then push out, and then they should come out. Now, I can only demonstrate on one because since it's cold, these parts are going to be really brittle, and I don't want to break anything. So, hopefully, that was enough demonstration, but for now... I don't know where to put this. For now, we're just going to take this off. So this comes out easily. It just slides out. And as you noticed, it might have been broken down here. 
in the middle. So that means that you can easily bend it out when you want to take it out. And don't worry about them separating because they're connected by this uh, rubber in the middle. All right, so just finagle it out and the windshield cowl's off. Almost as tall as me. All right. Oh, okay, so let's like, take it out now. Just make sure that when you take it out, there are nothing attached. And there we go. The bottom half of the cowl with what I think is the windshield wiper mechanism.